come if you know the, the bus I'm supposed to get doesn't come, I'll get a bus to the, the, the train station and then take, take a taxi from there. So I stood there, a bus came along that has you know says it goes to this same area. So I said to the driver, Does it go to this place? He said it takes long, it takes he says it takes 20 minutes more than the one I was waiting on. And I thought, I said, no, 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 no. And so I stood at the bus stop waiting for the bus to take me, a bus to take me to the station where I had to pick up a taxi. And guess what? The bus that I'm supposed to take, the one that I missed, another one came along, which is so unusual. So unusual, it came along. And I said, Lord, I know you're working. I know you're still working. So I got on the bus anyway. And um, it, it was, you know, um, it was quite quick. And I got to the place, and believe it or not, when I got to the place, I thought I'd be late, I'd be in distress, and uh, I'd have to explain, because I'd not been to this event before. I didn't know what to expect. And when I went there, it was just an open thing, an open thing where you people just went in at any time. And, you know, just do what they had to do before this. They had the form was set in. So I know it's gone. And to top it all, Amen. when I, I was supposed to come back, the Lord provided somebody to give me a lift back home. So I know he was working. I know it's working. And I just want to give him praise and glory. The main thing is to trust him when you know he's on the job, when you know he's doing it. Trust him despite the obstacles because there was traffic, 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 traffic all along the way. And, you know, you, you, you'd be tempted to doubt. But thank God, it did fulfill it. Amen. Amen. I think I'm here. I think we yeah. testify still, but I got to allow Sister Colleen to say what she has to say. Praise God. Sister Colleen, you have anything to say? I was only saying amen, amen. but what I can say, I'm not, it's not, mine isn't specific, on any, I'm not going to say anything in spe specific, but just to say how God has been speaking, it's like, it's like in these days, you know, I don't have to wait long for him to answer or confirm something. You know, I might be thinking something or wondering something or asking a question. And then before I know it, I'm either watching somebody speaking on it and giving me the answer. Or I'm reading something and I'm getting the answer. And things things that I kind of, I don't know about you, but I have a way of if I read something in the Bible and I want, say Jabez, for example, where he says, enlarge my territory. I might say, Lord, enlarge my territory. Or oh, like Zerubbabel, you know, being a signatory and that I put my name in there, that kind of thing. And all what I see, you did that years ago. And what I'm seeing now is that it, God confirming things. When you've forgotten it, he hasn't forgotten it. When you ask from your heart and, you know, you ask a few, you keep saying it and keep declaring it. Then when you least expect it or when you're not expecting, you see God confirm. It's like he's speaking direct to you and confirming things that this is what you are. This is what I've made you and that kind of thing. So, yeah, I'm just basking in his presence and hearing from him in Jesus name. Amen. 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 Oh, glory to God. I almost out of time. Anyhow. Hallelujah. But the Bible says something. It says, He that cometh to God must believe that He is. And He's a reward of them that diligently seek Him. So we must expect God to move. You know, we must expect miracles. You know, because we're not serving a dead God. We serve in a God that answer prayer. He may or may not answer it when you want him to answer it. But indeed, him answer in his time. Amen. And sometimes he will give a tell tale sign, as Sister Carlin say, Sister Mariam say, and Sister Merlin and Sister um, Diane say. That he will give us telltale sign that indeed he is doing it. Amen. But there's an excitement in my spirit anyhow. Because yeah. I know 
that have been saying some things for the longest while, years, years I've been saying it. And what I'm saying it, you know, I won't be, be happy saying it. People will begin to see. They won't, they, 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 they will begin to see. I won't have to say it. They will see it for themselves. Amen. So we thank God because that is our hope. That God who is faithful will bring his word to pass in his time. Yeah. Amen. I'm saying make all things beautiful in his time. Amen. And there's a scripture in the book of Psalms. And him say, bring forth fruit in his season. So when are your season, you will bring yeah. forth fruit. Amen. Amen. You will Amen. bring forth fruit. When are your season, you will shine. You will shine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and brother Daniel, yeah. mm. what I've noticed is that sometimes it's, we have to go through a process before we can get us to that place. So looking back now, I realize, oh yeah, you were processing me all this time before I could get there. Amen. Okay, you you reach already. <laughs> not, not, not quite, but you know, just at, at that further stage. <laughs> Uh, we are on the, uh, we're still on the on, on the journey, you know. We're still on the journey. Amen. We're still on the journey. We thank God and we bless Him and we praise Him for this time of prayer. You know, um, be, before um, me, me even start the meeting, I spend quite a lot of time praying. You know, because it's important to pray. You know, and I would advise everybody online. When you come off of the line, continue praying. Continue praying. Because God wants to speak not only to me, He wants to speak to every one of us. Every one of us. And the more you, you, you pray, the more the Bible says, draw near to God, and He will draw near unto you. So the more you pray, you are draw near to Him, and He will draw near to you. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Bless His holy name.